Hi, and welcome to HUDKing.com, your source for real virtual tours of HUD homes in and around the San Antonio and Houston area. I've been specializing in HUD homes since 1996, and in 2012, I started filming real virtual tours like the one you're about to watch. So connect with me by clicking on one of our social media links, or if you're watching this video on YouTube, click the subscribe button to be instantly notified of new uploaded videos. Now on to the home. We are here in the Deerbrook Estates subdivision located up near Umble off of 1960. We're standing in front of 20419 Oak Lodge Meadow. That's 20419 Oak Lodge Meadow. This is a nice three bedroom, two and a half bath, two story home. Has a two car garage. It's approximately 1,758 square feet and it was built in 2016. It sits on about a 5,600 square foot lot and it is eligible for HUD's $100 down payment incentive. The exterior of this home is mostly brick. There is some hardy plank around the soffit and fascia and around the upper parts of the sides and back. It has a charming little small porch. And it's a relatively new neighborhood. As I mentioned before, HUD will allow repair money if you're interested in borrowing money to do some of the repairs that the home might need. It is an option for you if you're an owner, occupant, buyer. Now this home also appears to be equipped with some uh, camera equipment. Right above the garage you have a camera there and then I noticed over here on the porch it also has another camera as well as a camera doorbell. So that's kind of nice, giving you a little more security. The exterior looks in good condition. Let's take a look at the backyard and then we'll look at the inside. When we step into the backyard, we step to it through the living room and it's a pretty good sized backyard. It grades down towards the home. And exterior wise, like I said, it's in decent condition. I think I would consider constructing a little covered patio in the back. If you'll notice the neighbors have a covered patio, something you might want to do. But exterior wise, in pretty decent condition. The yard is pretty basic. No trees or anything, but definitely enough room for a pool if you wanted to put an in-ground pool. Let's take a look at the inside. Well, as we step inside, you'll notice it has a very high entryway. Staircase takes you upstairs to the bedrooms. All three bedrooms will be upstairs. You have ceramic tile on the entryway, which is pretty neutral. You could probably salvage that, but the carpeting will definitely need to be replaced. In fact, I think the whole home's going to need carpeting and and painting or some kind of flooring. You don't have to come back with carpet, put whatever you like, but you can borrow money to do that if you want. To the left here, we have your half bath, which is a nice convenience for your guests, which is a, just a commode and a single vanity, pretty basic bathroom, just needs a fresh coat of paint. To the right of that, we have your two car garage, a good sized two car garage with a water softening system. We then have your family room. We've got a TV mount here, and this in turn opens up into your kitchen and your dining room. So this is really a kind of a modest starter home, a, starter two-story home if you will. Come over to your dining area. They continued with that ceramic tile in the kitchen and they have granite for the countertop. So pretty decent upgrade there. I don't think you really need to do anything in the kitchen. You could probably salvage the flooring if you wanted to do that. Maybe put a fresh coat of paint on the walls and the cabinets if you like. It has an electric oven. You have your refrigerator and a small pantry here. Undermount dual sink. And that is it for the downstairs. Let's take a look upstairs. As I said, I think the carpeting needs to be replaced. It's, it's beyond its use, its life, as they say. Now, when we get upstairs to the left here, we have your indoor uh, washer and dryer connections upstairs. That's a nice convenience. To the right over here, we have bedroom number one, a good sized bedroom. This bedroom is the master bedroom right above the garage. And it's in decent shape. You might want to put a fresh coat of paint and paint the window sill here. You'll see that they, pro they probably left those windows open so they got a little bit of water damage. We come over to the master walk-in closet. Good sized closet. And then we come over to the master bathroom. Now, it's a good sized master bathroom. You have a big garden tub. You have your water closet over here. Come back around and show you. You do have a separate shower. It's kind of a basic shower. You could probably tile that and make it really nicely, uh, make it really nice. You have a single vanity here. You could probably upgrade that to dual vanities if you like. And then let me pan up and show you. It looks like there's a little bit of sheetrock tape damage there. Typically what I notice that tends to be is condensation that leaks from not changing the water filters, but you want to have that investigated. I'm not changing the air conditioning filters, not the water, so condensation builds up. Down the hallway to the right here, we have bedroom number two, which needs a fresh coat of paint, some flooring, maybe a screen. We have full bathroom number two here, which is also another basic shower and tub combo, a nice single vanity. And then bedroom number three, which needs a fresh coat of paint and some flooring and a windowsill. So that's about it. The home really needs very minor work. 
eligible for the $100 down payment and money to you do the repairs. Let me give you a summary. Well, there you have it, 20419 Oak Lodge Meadow. That's 20419 Oak Lodge Meadow up in Humble, Texas. This is a nice three bedroom, two and a half bath, two story starter home. It's eligible for the $100 down payment incentive with repair money if you'd like. And it's listed right now for only $230,000. So if you're interested in this home or you have any questions, please call me at 210-706-0616. My name is Jonathan. I am the HUD King, and I want to help you find your castle.